Hi, this is Danny again. I'm working on my um, lithium ion phosphate battery project again. And uh, my problem is that I need a voltmeter to put on the battery, one of those small voltmeters. And I'm tired of using my, the only voltmeter I have. And so I was, I was hoping that um, you'd enjoy, join me in this excitement I've had because I've found a new accurate small voltmeter I can use for my batteries. And so um, that's what this video is about. And it's on Amazon. It's pretty cheap. Now we're going to look at the Drock voltmeter I found. It has a very high pre precision. Um, I'm testing it with an um, LM4040 module. And um, I got a DVM reading uh, of uh, 4.08. And this um, and the Drock is actually um, reading 4.09. Um, uh, 4.0959 so um, let's see if it's still reading that <laughs> there it is so um, I just wanted to show you my setup here so here's um, over here is my LM4040 okay and I've got that basically hooked up to my Adreno um, just, to, just for the supply for the 5 volt supply and um, I basically have there's uh, this this unit has a voltage sense and it has um, and it has the regular power right so I'm sort of hooking on to um, power onto the Arduino on the five volt on the Arduino and then what I'm doing is I'm coming uh, over to the um, the LM4040, and I'm and I'm terminating it. Uh, I usually use it to terminate on on the A ref pin on the Adreno, but instead I'm coming I'm coming over here, to, uh, and we're basically um, reading um, th that straight off. So as you can see, it's quite accurate. Um, here's the range it's supposed to be: 4.0919 to 4. Um, one and it's it's pretty much right in the middle of that which is darn good so um, I just wanted to show you one other thing so if I just take my probe ah, and I uh, pull off the drock and I put on the um, voltmeter I'm reading 4.08 Okay, on my voltmeter, which um, so it's it's uh, actually not quite as accurate as um, this this little voltmeter here. And I, I wanted to let you know one thing: it's not good to share the A ref. Um, you basically have to just put one one device on it. Um, you don't want to. You don't want to have the Adreno sucking off the, the, the 4040 module at the same time that this is. And I'll kind of show you um, a little bit more. Thanks. So here's the unit I got on Amazon. Um, it, um, it's got a five digit display. Uh, and what I think attracted me to it, it, uh, basically had this um, accuracy level 0.03 percent it's really hard to beat that uh, I'll show you roughly what I'm using for a reference it is a LM4040 uh, this guy here Henry's bench um, did an article on using this as an input into the a ref onto the in in the Arduino and that allows the Arduino to um, produce a much better uh, voltage reading and I'm using lithium-ion batteries so I need a super accurate uh, voltage rating because uh, reading because I'm going to be switching on a power supply uh, so here he's where he's kind of calling out it should be four four zero nine six and that's kind of what I was um, doing and the board I'm using is um, is this you can buy this on um, on Amazon also it's a 
it's the 4040 board uh, and let's see what else I have here for you uh, that's that's pretty much it I got two units in the package I thought that I was going to possibly get five but I think this five means it's five digits but I ended up getting two units in the package I don't know if you know if I was supposed to or not I didn't know what to expect um, so that's pretty much it I hope um, you uh, find this useful I certainly am happy with this I was using some low pre precision stuff uh, like um, I was using this um, and it, it just didn't quite cut it with the lithium ion batteries it wasn't that accurate as my voltmeter now I've got something that I think uh, is is pretty much more accurate than my voltmeter I just have two digits of accuracy on my voltmeter so thanks a lot for watching